were good, you know. <laughs> wow. On the joke. rocks, but most is on the rocks. That's a joke. <laughs> What's your happiness, bud? Uh, we are heading to San Diego for just a nice oh, long right. weekend. Just uh, rented a, like an Airbnb on the beach. We're not really going to interact with anybody. Just kind of a chance to get out of our house, which we've been locked in for months, yeah. uh, and go lock ourselves in a different house. Spend a little time on the beach, being safe, obviously. So and, you'll uh, be off like what Monday and Tuesday, right? Correct. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be back on Wednesday. Um, but yeah, we're looking forward to that. My birthday's on Monday, so that's not the reason we're going, but it's just a nice, uh, nice opportunity to celebrate that. For sure. Brian, what's your happiness, buddy? It's the same as it always is on Fridays. It's movie night at my house. I'm going to stop by a brewery, fill up my growler, and watch a movie. And pick up that margarita for your wife. Don't forget her, right? <laughs> I always get my wife a margarita. Don't forget about her. And she nice. loves it. Okay, Jill stepped away for a second. 866-544-MY-FAN. Text in 31043. What is your happiness? Let's put a smile on your face this morning. Call Valentine now. 866-544-MY-FM. COVID-19 is hitting underserved communities and people of color harder than others, but there's something you can do. iHeartRadio is proud to partner with Global Citizen for a campaign called Global Goal. Unite for our future. We're calling on world leaders to commit funds to ensure that everyone everywhere can access COVID-19 tests, treatments, and vaccines. Join us to find out how we can use our collective voice to make sure no one is left behind. Exclusive performances from Coldplay, Shakira, Justin and Bieber, Jake Balvin, Miley Cyrus, and more. Appearances including Chris Rock, Ricky Gervais, Charlize Theron, David Beckham, and hosted by Dwayne Johnson. Watch on NBC and listen right here tomorrow night at 8. City is proud to partner with Global Citizen to support Global Goal Unite for Our Future, a campaign which aims to ensure COVID-19 treatment is available for everyone everywhere and to help rebuild communities disproportionately impacted by the virus. Join us to help ensure no one is left behind in this pandemic. Let's unite for our future. Hi, it's Ellen Kay for CompanyCovidTesting.com. Are you worried about your business being a COVID safe environment for your staff and customers? If you have over 100 employees, CompanyCovidTesting.com will come to you with full service doctor verified COVID testing and scheduled retesting of your employees on site at your business. Their tests are highly reliable and fast, both for the virus as well as for antibodies. For more information, go to CompanyCovidTesting.com. That's CompanyCovidTesting.com. The pitter-patter, splitter-splatter of Sunday morning. Wait, no, that's bacon, and it's spitting all over your PJs. Stains can ruin any moment. Get them out with Tide, America's number one detergent. If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide. Streaming July 3rd on Disney+. Plus. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Hamilton. The journey, the dream, the triumph, the Tony, Grammy, and Pulitzer Prize winning phenomenon is here. Hamilton, rated PG-13, may be inappropriate for children under 13. Streaming July 3rd, exclusively on Disney+. Plus. Sweet, juicy, delectable summer produce is in at Sprouts Farmer's Market. It's Jill from Valentine in the morning. Hurry in for the best in fresh seasonal fruits and veggies, guaranteed to quench your summertime cravings. From sweet, plump cherries to mouth-watering melons and juicy peaches, plums, and nectarines, they've picked the best in fresh just for you. Load up on these natural summer sweets before they're gone. Only at your local Sprouts Farmer's Market. Hey, it's Jill. Last week, I tried the Squeezed.com Juice Cleanse. Now, if you listen to Valentine in the morning, you know about my sweet tooth and my love of dessert. And I wanted to try and break some of those bad eating habits. Squeezed is so tasty, really fresh, full of flavor, and so many benefits, like boosting immunity and feeling energized. It gave me the reset that I needed. And at Squeezed.com, you get same-day delivery. Order by 1 p.m., and it's delivered to your door by 9 p.m. With no contact delivery. Squeezed.com juice cleanses. Try three days or more. The Home Depot is cooking up new ways to start summer here and bring summer home. From online ordering to free delivery and convenience store pickup, we're helping make sure taking care of your summer projects is a breeze. And summer savings on all your favorite brands make things even easier. So freshen up the deck 
Fire up the grill. Summer's here. And it's as close as your own backyard. The Home Depot. How doers get more done. Tell Alexa to play 104.3 My FM on iHeartRadio. 104.3 My FM and ABC7 are celebrating 50 years of pride in L.A. Don't miss appearances from Katy Perry, Erasure's Andy Bell, the cast of Pose, High School Musical The Series, and more. Take a look back to where it all started and celebrate how far we've come. L.A. Pride's 50th celebration tomorrow night at 8 on ABC7. Sponsored by Macy's Backstage, northbound side of the 101 as you're coming up on Tampa. That earlier crash was cleared from the roadway. The drive's still a bit busy coming away from the 405. You'll see delays up ahead almost to DeSoto before it improves. Southbound side of the 405 is still kind of tough there from just before the 101. You'll see brake lights out to about sunset. Northbound side of the 405 just past the 101. They're saying there's some kind of metal debris that's in the roadway there. Southbound side of the 5, you're heading through Orange County just before we get to the 55. Three cars involved, two right lanes that are blocked off. Lots of debris in the roadway as well, so traffic is backing up as you're coming away from Chapman Avenue. And if you're coming out of Garden Grove, eastbound side of the 22, just before you get to Fairview, watch out for an SUV that broke down that's blocking their right lane. At Macy's Backstage, they're thrilled to welcome you back with great deals on summer styles like activewear, shorts, and tees, $19.99 and under, and beauty, $9.99 and under, off price, on trend, arriving daily. More at Macy'sBackstage.com. That's your traffic. I'm Tony Jordan with Valentine in the Morning on 1043 My FM. All right, Tony, thank you very much. The weather today clouded this morning, mostly sunny this afternoon. Temps to 70s to 80s for the weekend, partly sunny highs in the 80s. We're doing happy news right now, 866-544-MY-FAN. You're texting in at 31043. Kenny, what do you got in the text line, brother? Uh, well, this one is not really happy news, but I still wanted to read it. It says, oh. shout out to all the nurses uh, striking at Riverside Community Hospital, fighting for the safety of their patients and themselves. That seemed important to read. Another one that kind of ties in with that, Alyssa said, hi, my name is Alyssa. I finally got hired in the nursing specialty I wanted after two years. Also, I'm moving into my very first apartment all on my own. Congratulations to you. That's cool. Allison said, I'm going to have my first great niece. So I guess the other oh, ones wow. are just mediocre. Yeah. <laughs> stop. <laughs> stop. Dad jokes um, never stop on this show. It seems yeah. like. This one says, my happy news is my sister's baby showers this weekend, and she's having her fifth child, first girl. Uh, and then a uh, nice text that says, today is my son's fifth birthday. Happy birthday, Carson. Daddy loves you. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, Dina, good morning. How are you doing today? Hi, how are you? We're doing all right. What's your happiness? What's going on? So my daughter is graduating from eighth grade. Her graduation was postponed, and it's rescheduled for tomorrow morning. Okay, how are they going to do it? It's going to be like a drive-by type thing? What's happening? She goes to a Catholic school, okay. so they are going to do it in the church, and they're just doing the social distancing sure. where there's only the parents and the graduate allowed mm -hmm. and masks required. Yeah. So... Man, I got to tell you, I went to a Catholic high school, St. Bernard's, and mm -hmm. my school, I was following along on Instagram, man, they did it right for graduation for the kids. They had all the kids show up one at a time. So it was a big, long affair, I guess. Maybe during a school day or something like that. They'd show up, they'd go into the church on their own. Uh, they went down and got their you know, diploma or whatever it was right there at the end, took a picture and stuff. And then they exit the church. Then the next kid came in one at a time. But what they did is they filmed everything with such separation. Then they edited the whole thing together of music. And you would have thought all the kids were flowing in right next.